Good morning. Uh, this is just a, a follow-up on uh, the meeting that was uh, held here yesterday where the National Management Committee held deliberations about uh, the forthcoming uh, National Delegates Convention of the Democratic Party. Uh, today, the National Executive Committee is meeting to get an update uh, on uh, the preparations. Uh, the convention is going to take place on uh, 20th of February, Sunday, at the Bombers of Kenya. Uh, but uh, as a person uh, that uh, is at the National Assembly, I've taken the liberty to advise the National Executive Committee that uh, we have had uh, cases where members of county assemblies sometimes desire to vie for positions of um, member of parliament either in the National Assembly or in the Senate or even uh, to vie for positions of governor. I've taken the liberty to advise that uh, it is against the constitution for a member of the county assembly, specifically Article 99, Clause 2, Paragraph D, bars a member of a sitting member of a county assembly from running for position of member of parliament unless they resign six months to the election date. And therefore, uh, because of that, and because I know we have several members of county assemblies who may be desirous of uh, vying for positions of member of parliament in the National Assembly or Senate, it is only fair that I draw their attention to the clear provisions of the Constitution, not just the Elections Act. Therefore, that I took the liberty to just alert ourselves because we are a party that uh, has been encouraging many of our members in the county assemblies to also vie for other positions.